A warm one ahead of us today. Temperatures jumping into the 80s. We've also got a chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms trying to move towards parts of five country tomorrow morning. This time uh, we do anticipate that there will be scattered thunderstorms that start to develop out in western Oklahoma and parts of Kansas. I don't think the ones in western Oklahoma are a threat to us tomorrow morning. I think the ones in Kansas that get going overnight, those uh, the steering pattern is going to try to maybe shift those more towards the southeast and uh, they're going to try to survive the trip. Certainly areas near the Kansas Oklahoma line have the best shot. How far south can they go? Uh, and it's one of those situations with this kind of setup, this kind of pattern. Honestly, it's hard to say exactly where they'll die. We know that they'll likely be weakening, uh, possibly trying to fizzle out as they move away, and it can happen very rapidly with these kind of setups. Um, but uh, something that we'll just have to wait till they get going tonight, see where they develop, and then watch the overnight trends. But tomorrow morning, we'll likely be watching some scattered showers and thunderstorms, at least just to the northwest of us. Uh, the best chance to see those move into five country would be far northwestern Arkansas. We'll continue to keep our eyes on it. Uh, again, the best chance for severe weather should stay outside of our area, but we could see a few scattered showers and thunderstorms trying to move in tomorrow morning. Northwest Arkansas, that's our first rain chance. That'll kick off another active pattern heading our way. A little cool in some spots this morning, some low 50s out there. 51 Fayetteville, 60 on the warmer side. That's coming in at the airport there in Fort Smith. Everyone in between those lower 50s to lower 60s. Uh, for Northwest Arkansas, what a beautiful day on tap for us. We got to the mid to upper 70s yesterday. We're going into the low to mid 80s for highs today. A little bit more of a southerly breeze kicking up 5 to 15 miles per hour for northwest Arkansas. It'll be a little lighter for us in the River Valley. We'll look for winds to be more 5 to 10 miles per hour, but we could have a few areas that uh, go a little bit more 5 to 15 uh, as we get into the afternoon. That breeze kind of mixing that air up, making it feel a little more comfortable for us. Uh, so we'll watch that tomorrow. Maybe that scattered shower in northwest Arkansas even better into northeast Oklahoma. And then as we get into Thursday, that's the next best chance for widespread rain for all the five country disturbance coming in, especially the River Valley wash is maybe the best chance. Uh, could see a lingering shower possibly early Friday. And then as we get into Saturday and Sunday, we'll see some isolated to scattered shower chances starting to build back in. Can't roll out. Maybe a strong storm setting up for us on Thursday. We'll watch that. Some gusty winds and hail would be the top threat. And then maybe a few uh, strong storms with some uh, gusty winds and hail trying to develop as we go into the weekend as well. Lots of 70s and 80s out there. Last day of April, May officially starts tomorrow. I feel like 